A day after meeting with President Muhammadu Buhari, the Inspector General of Police, IGP, Ibrahim Idris, has announced the deployment of additional five units of the mobile force, the Special Forces, Aerial Surveillance Helicopters and Special Police Joint Intelligence and Investigation Teams to Benwa and Rivers State respectively. IGP Idris also placed commissioners of police and its personnel in the affected states on red alert just as he has directed 24-hour crime prevention and visibility patrols throughout the country. The new order came from the IGP in a statement released by Jim Masood, the force public relations officer, who said Idris ordered the commissioners of police in charge of Benue, Rivers and other contiguous units to the two states. To this end, the Deputy Inspector General of Police, Operations, has been dispatched by the IGP to Banu State to muster, coordinate and supervise the implementation of the new security strategies put in place by the force to put an immediate end to the senseless killings and violence unleashed on innocent Nigerians by suspected herdsmen and other criminal elements in the two states. Police Aerial Surveillance Helicopters, five units of police mobile force, police special forces who have been deployed along with additional conventional police personnel, the Counter-Terrorism Unit, CTU, Police Explosive Ordnance Department, UD, and Special Police Joint Intelligence and Investigation Teams to Benwa and Rivers stayed to work with the police personnel on the ground and this is to bring new impetus to the efforts of the force to nip in the bud further attacks in the mentioned states. In Benus date, eight suspected herdsmen arrested at the scene of the killings are currently being prosecuted, six of them were remanded to prison custody while the other two suspects arrested at a different scene of crime are being arraigned in court. The Assistant Inspector General of Police in Zone 4, Makur D, and Zone 6, Kulibar have been mandated by the Inspector General of Police to convey stakeholders' meetings in the affected states and also supervise the police investigation and intelligence teams, and other police special squads deployed by the IGP to the two states, the statement said. Idris commiserated with victims of the killings in the two states as well as the government's expressing hope that normalcy would return to the areas soon.